Hi and welcome to the video How to carry out Shakia headlifting exercise. In this video I'll guide you through the indications, the instructions for the patient and the desired impact of this exercise. Shakia exercise is indicated when you perceive certain things during the laparoscopy. For example, an implant high laryngeal excursion, the situ in the sinus piriforms, aspiration or penetration after the swallow, or a reduced opening width of the upper esophageal sphincter. These observations are often related to an implant relaxation of the pharyngeal esophageal segment. That means that the upper esophageal sphincter doesn't relax and open properly for letting in food, liquids, or a tablet. For the Shakir exercise, an isometric and isokinetic version were developed. The exercise needs to be done over six weeks, three times per day. For the isometric version, or called sustained hold, lie flat on your back without a pillow. Lift your head as if looking at your toes. Hold your head up for 60 seconds. Lay your head back down and rest for 60 seconds. Repeat three times. For the isokinetic version, or called lift and lower, lie flat on your back without a pillow. Lift your head as if looking at your toes, lower your head again, and complete three sets of stretching repetitions. The desired impact of Shakir exercise is to strengthen the thyrohyoid, the mylohyoid, the geniohyoid and the anterior belly of the digastric muscle. Another desired impact is to reduce the amount of residue in the sinus piriforms, to eliminate aspiration and penetration after the swallow and to increase the opening width of the upper esophageal sphincter. Thanks for watching.